Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name's Stephen. Uh, I'm just in the process of uh, I started building the uh, Airfix 148 scale bolt and pole defiant, and uh, I thought I'd show you a bit of progress that we've got up to up to yet. So let's take a look. Okay, so I've uh, sprayed it black initially. Both the fuse large jones and some of the cockpit stuff. Uh, I've scraped off all the dowels on the uh, dashboard because I'm going to use the uh, head wide uh, photo etch set. And uh, so our next, I'm not going to paint that inter interior green. But I'm going to paint all the rest of the stuff in interior green with this. Bit of a model there. So when I've done that, we'll have another look. Okay. See you shortly. Okay, so so you can see. I've uh, spread up the interior green from Vallejo. And I've... Uh, Gloss it over with a bit of future floor polish. So I'm going to uh, do a bit of a black wash on it. Uh, that paint's really rather nice. It sprays beautiful. I'm sure most of you know that you know. Probably all got it. And I've also started on the uh, some of the interior set with the Edward stuff. Um, That's the, uh, what do they call it? The instrument panel. Looks quite nice. I've glued them all together with the uh, Umbrol's clear fix because then you get sort of a shine where the dowels would have been, the glass would have been. And is this a seat as well? Right. Yeah, that's pretty detailed, I think. It's come out all right. Uh, when I took the parts off, the part broke here, so I put a bit of stretch sprue on it, cover it up, and uh, they're all ready for a wash. Um, I started one of the side panels as well. Which hopefully looks okay. And uh, carrying on with that now. So I'll see you again shortly. Well, okay, right, so I've uh, done a dark wash. And to be fair, I've never done it before. And I think I made a bit of a mess, really. Uh, too dark. I've tried getting some of it off, but uh, anyway, I've basically finished the uh, cockpit part now, I think. Mm. Don't know what to make of the ebb wide stuff, especially some of the that goes on the side. I don't know, too bad to be fair. But I'm cra a bit crap at it. Only ever done it once before. So I'm ready to join up the uh, halves now. So I'll see where that goes and we'll come back to it. Okay. So I shall see you shortly. Oh, well. Uh, before we have a look at the fuselage, let's have a look at the. Uh, Edward instructions for the uh, Defiant, the, uh, what do you call it, the um, instrument panel, it's really nice, I have to admit, it's really nice, it's built, it's inside the plane there, I'll took a still of it, and I'll put that after, and there's the, these are the other bits, the side, side panels or what have you. Uh, some things I am added 
I didn't cut out the throttle quadrant because uh, <clears throat> if I had, I'd have probably broke something. So I've left that, just painted that up black and what have you. Uh, this top bit is for the turret, so I'm not up to there yet. But most of this is all done. I had particular trouble with this, uh, not wanting to go in properly. But overall, quite liked it. Um, It's only the second time I've ever used this kind of stuff, and I've used most of it. That up there is for uh, the turret, as I said before. Also, I also got seat belts, steel seat belts for for the uh, <coughs> for the seat. And these are the instructions for that. Again. Um, they've gone in really nice. I took a still of that, and I'll post. You know that'll be in the video. And this part here is for the uh, turret as well. So uh, if you ever fancy having a crack at that, I've, I've, uh, I've glued all, most of it in with uh, super glue. Either uh, this, which was a pen off market, <laughs> not bad. Or, uh, I've used this as well. This just floods out of the tube. So it goes everywhere. So I'm not keen on using that to be fair. Uh, <coughs> this is the uh, fret for the seats. Obviously I've cut them out and used them. Uh, so that's the Edward stuff. I've glued the fuselage together. It's uh, gone together pretty well. To be fair, um, if I can, you can see the seat belts there. It's nice, and the instrument panel. Too much. Just there. So I've had to put some tape there to hold that together. Probably because of the uh, instrument panel. I've had to squeeze that together and hold it to hold it with some uh, tape. But I'm quite surprised about how everything has gone together really. Just squeezed it, just put some Tamiya cement on and squeezed it and it's all glued together. Um, I'll need a bit of filler there I think. Because that's where I've cut it off, made a mistake cutting it off the sprue but not to worry. Anyway, so... I'll get on with the wings and things now. <laughs> yeah. So up to yeah, up to yeah. It's a very nice kit. Can't fault it. To be honest, uh, cut them out. Those stairs across there for the that hold that uh, got the gap right for the turret. And uh, as I've said before. If you uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you if you want as well. Uh, any comments, any questions, and I'll answer them as better best I can. So, if you fancy building this kit, I can I can recommend it. Anyway, so that's me for signing off for now. Catch me in the next video when I've done the wings and things. Okay, thanks very much. Bye.